going back to Moscow. beds we got a nightstand we got nice lights we got a tv pretty good and the bathroom is in here and uh i like it so this hotel is called the sunflower hotel or the katarina park hotel um yeah you know i don't know how they changed it or when they changed it but it's a really great view and it's like in the suburbs, so I'd like to see how that is because it's about an hour away from the station that we were at and it's an hour away from, an hour and a half away from the airport. So here's one more look at the view and then we're going to go sightsee. <music> Okay, so we're on our way to the Red Square, and it's looking pretty awesome. Look at this hotel, the Ford Fields. It's huge, and it just leads right to the square. These buildings are so breathtaking. All right, back to the tour. But the real, the real spot awaits at the end of that road. Do you see that? That's where I want to go. <sighs> okay, so we tried asking to go into, you know, where the Kremlin was with that cool looking church is. I don't know if it's a church. It's a cathedral. Anyway, so it's closed off because Putin is on the other side. So it's gonna open like in a couple hours, but hey, we are, we're near Putin. We're near Putin. Okay, so we asked to go, we asked one of the volunteers like to direct us where the mall is and he gave us like a cute little map. Oh, yeah, he gave us a cute little map and it, it's actually pretty specific, even though it's all drawn.
called La Nina, which is like mango with mint. This is our water bottle. And our water bottle. I don't know, mango with mint and other stuff and other juices, but it's really like good. good popular mall like it's one of the hot spots to go to it's called the goom or the gum g-u-m mall and it's right where the red square is After an hour wait, we finally got our tickets to go inside St. Basil's Cathedral. to leave soon. Spasiba. This is Michael. Tannen. What's up? <laughs> I want in and out. I know, right? Gonna go back to LA and get and, some in and out. And Mexico. We just met another set of people who are from California as well, so we're just, we're just taking over. That's right. LA and the California flag. <laughs> Krispy Kreme place with my bag. Uh, it's absolutely delicious. And now we're gonna go watch the Columbia game. We're gonna go find a spot. Mm. that there's so many hijabis like everywhere like right there like so many hijabis in Russia and it actually is pretty exciting
above me, imagine how it'll look like at night. Now the next day and most likely our final day of touring so we're gonna check out one more tourist location called the Kremlin and we're gonna eat and have a good time and okay so after I guess an hour of waiting we finally made it through the security so we can go through the Kremlin so I'm gonna commence the time-lapse no. Okay, so we just finished one cathedral and I think we have like one, two, three. Okay, so I tried recording in the first one, but you know, I decided to be respectful <laughs> and not record, but this was, we just finished number two and then Okay, so we just got done with cathedral number four. Time to go to number five. Okay, cathedral number one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we just got finished all the cathedrals. Um, and now we're just, I guess, sightseeing the place. It's actually pretty nice. So, cue music. So what we're walking to right now is the Alexander Gardens. Don't, don't quote me on that. But I'm not going to quote her on that. But I'm guessing it is because it's a garden and there's a fountain. So therefore we're walking to the Alexander Gardens. Okay, Wait, so <laughs> we just finished exploring the whole Kremlin. So I think this concludes all the touring. So now what we're going to do is we're going to be chilling for the next day and then move on back to Los Angeles. Okay, so I wasn't going to vlog today, but I really wanted to because today is a very important day. Today, Argentina and Portugal plays, so I'm kind of torn in between, so I'm wearing both of them. But they're not playing against each other, so I'm allowed to wear this. <laughs> so there's this restaurant that we went to for three days in a row. So maybe some starters. 
No, I think we're good. Thanks. We just keep coming back because one, all the waiters are cute. Two, the food is really good. Go back to number one. We're mainly number one. We met a guy named Alexander, and then second day we met a guy named Tim, and today the third guy is named Sergi. What's his name? Sergi. Yeah, really cute. And today we got a fan because this small is not insulated, at ventilated all. It's been at all. Since like 1820. Yeah, this building was here. This built in 1820, 18, 1820. And they didn't decide to put any ventilation after that. Look, even mysteries. But they don't want to. Third day in a row. Third day in a row with this drink because it's so good. And the same pasta. Three times in a row. And finally the dessert. Two days in a row. I'm a person who likes to eat the same thing and barely tries new things when I already have something in mind. Okay, so we got the seats to watch the game in the pub. I'm holding down the fort for six people. Okay, we just got our luggage checked. We got our boarding oh, pass. <laughs> and now we're on our way home. Okay, so my sister got my car for me so I can go. Oh, ah, I didn't even say it. Well, I just came back from the airport. You can see over here. I, last minute, my agency emailed me saying, hey, I have an audition for Nike at 5 p.m. and it's now 3 o'clock p.m. So I'm going to see if I have time to make it home. But let me see how long the traffic is. <laughs> Alright, so the audition is at a park. And I just see some studio stuff. So we'll see how this goes. This is my audition. It was literally the worst audition ever. I literally didn't land any of my flips. <sighs> I'm disappointed, but oh well. I literally just came back from Russia, so I have no idea what the hell I was doing with the uh, with the air awareness part. So yeah. Alright, well, now I gotta go back home. Finally. 